Nothing quite like jumping in a cold truck at 7 in the morning. It's about minus 14. Oh well. It, but we are starting to see mountains. Check that out. Ooh. As we go around this bend, it becomes pretty spectacular. Well, James, guess what, man? I've hiked with new people. 10 new hikers. You're number 11 this year, man. Ooh, lucky 11. Yeah, yeah, it's so fun to hike with new people. <laughs> Christian was number one new person this year. James Falls. Sure looks different in winter. the big pack and setting up yeah yeah try it again i got i got you oh we're a little drunk no we're a little drunk later we'll do it later just blow on it for now just do something in it <laughs> Definitely the problem with winter, it is now not even five, it's quarter to five and there's no daylight left. And the sun's going down and once the sun goes down, it gets cold. Oh my god, it looks great. That's turkey. We got a gravy. We got all sorts of goodies. Got mushrooms. Yeah, mine are getting a little overcooked here. That's fine. Everything's gonna be good. Christmas yeah, dinner got some, in the bush. Got some Christmas it on it. Nice. You got one last thing to come. Stuffing on and the gravy. What's today? December 1st? No. The yeah, the, <laughs> yeah, the second maybe. No, we, the Happy. It's not, it's not the shortest day of the year, but December what, the 7th, 7th or something? Yeah. Oh, I forgot about these guys. Stuff in cups. Oh my goodness. This is this should be against the law. I think it is. <laughs> <laughs> this is how we roll. Wow. Okay. Now I'll bring the gravy over and then you guys can uh grab Holy smokes, plates. Evan. I'd say this turned out better than <laughs> Oh my god. Wow. <laughs> 
And if I turn that way, let me put my headlight on high. Holy, yep. Get your camera ready. Let's do it. A little bit of snow. I'm just blown away. I mean, what an amazing year 2020 has been like I'm I'm just this is the culmination of the most amazing year I've had in terms of backpacking. Evan, he's pointing the camera or the light at me. Evan, man, I'm so glad I met you. JT, James, Christian, like this is this is the cul I'm almost in tears, man. This is so freaking amazing. So we are out here in the wilderness right now. We're not that far from the trailhead, but we are far in the bush. Evan has pushed us all year long, all year long, and everybody's taken from this man's uh, inspiration. So we've watched him cook all year for us, but today he challenged us. So he brought out this amazing meal, the, tur the turkey and the pork, but he wanted each one of us to make a dish and I'd say that everybody it's far surpassed <laughs> it's crazy your thoughts man like come on what a cool like this being able to do this finally with uh, you know we've talked about it oh, let me turn that off for you we've talked about this we wanted to do it for Thanksgiving actually and I just didn't work out and uh, you know we had to get everybody together early it's an early Christmas dinner but you know what they're everybody's gonna go back home and nobody's gonna forget this meal I'm more, I'm so impressed with what everyone Evan, you've done. inspired us, man. Like you you had a mission it's, at the beginning beginning of the or of last year, which is uh gourmet cooking in the backcountry. Like yeah, and we've this is it. the culmination. We, we, this is it. This well, is, I say, it's yeah. not the culmination because it's gonna get better. I, I said to get better. I said to James, how are we gonna top this? And we keep finding ways. Well, yeah. There's the man right there. JT is the first man who kind of I think you um I think JT blew away Evan. You made him happy last <laughs> month at Glacier Lake when you made that cake. I mean, he, he, I'm sure he said something, but maybe he didn't say enough. He said it to me. He said it to others. Like, he was so proud of the fact that, that people had, you in particular, that, that, that people had taken inspiration from him. I mean, you came out and you did that chocolate cake. He was blown away. So, perfect. But he's to, truly inspired me to, to push the limits and, and cooking in the backcountry and getting out of the bag. Yeah. Right? Like it's there's there's a time and a place for the for the bag, but there's a time and a place to to do a little bit of cooking in the backcountry. Absolutely. Country, so. Holy smokes. Uh, turned into a sangria. What are you making, Christian? I'm making a they call it fireside um, sipper. It is uh, apple slice uh, rum with maple syrup, sliced um, sliced lemon, and a little bit of boiled water. Goes down like a charm. So they'll freeze it, and, and, and then they'll thaw it, and the Thanks. first drips that come off of it, they keep everything else they get rid of. Scott, maybe? State bottle of Niagara and the Lake VQU Ice Wine Vidal 2015 Vidal Chateau des Charmes. Mm, it's all cheap. good stuff. 2015? Yeah, 2015. Nice. 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 I've drank in a long time. <laughs> <laughs> all right, just a quick video. It's our not quick video, quick clip. It's uh, just past midnight and we just had ourselves an amazing supper, dinner, Christmas dinner, evening in the wilderness. We're at uh, Eagle Lake and uh, um, just been a great night. So it's cold right now. It's about minus 15, minus 20. Going to go to bed. I'll be comfortable in a few minutes. What happens is I always get cramps in my feet uh, right away when I go to bed. But I'm going to put some uh, uh, heated pads, the, those... Um, uh, ferrous oxide pads that you expose to air and then they heat up. So I'll put those in my socks and I'm just going to go to bed and everything will be fine. So we'll see you guys in the morning at day one's in the bed. That was a good night's sleep. 
eight thirty. Let's see how this As you guys are still sleeping. Woke up and look at this. Heaven was kind enough to make us a life saving fire. <laughs> Oh, my hands are cold. <coughs> We're good, that's good. I think this one will last a bit. How'd you sleep? We all did. <laughs> yeah, I was decent for what I was expecting. Yeah. I was surprised that once I hit the sack, I went to bed and I didn't wake up till three. Yeah. And then after that, I call it the barbecue roll. So yeah, yeah. definitely almost precisely on the hour every hour, yeah. wake up and roll, adjust, and I'd fall back to sleep pretty fucking fast. Oh, thirsty, were you? Yeah. Well, I don't know where the water Well, boys, what do we think? Merry Christmas. Yeah. We made it. Successful yeah. trip. <laughs> yeah. Still alive. It's a good part of every morning. Waking up still alive in winter, warming up around that fire. We'll put that out. Everybody yeah. is backed up. backed up. What did we say, minus 20 last night? Wow, what a great evening. That was so much fun. So this is basically the conclusion of my 2020 season. Uh, between now and Christmas, I won't get to hike again, but uh, camera's cold on the hands. Hiked every single month uh, this year overnight. Um, January, February, March, April, all the way to December. In fact, this is my 24th overnight trip this year. I think I stayed under the stars about 51 nights. So, thanks everybody for uh, watching my videos all year, and uh, or longer for many of you. And uh, I'll be back in the new year. Merry Christmas, everybody! Happy New Year! He's chasing that. Oh, look at this! They're gonna headbutt. The rams are all horny. You can just see it in them, like the way they're moving. Folks, those are wild horses. We got pretty lucky today, Marty. Yeah. These are not domestic. They're as wild as wild can be.
Daddy's home. Hey guys. Hey guys. Hey guys. Luna. Luna. Luna, come here. Close the door. Come on, Luna. Bye, Luna. Come on in, Luna. Hey guys. Hi guys. Hi guys. Hi guys. Hi guys. Hi guys. Hi Tika. Hi Tika. Oh my God. Oh yeah. Happy. Jasper. Jasper. Look at Jasper. 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 Hi Luna. Luna, do your jumping. Luna! Hi! 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 Okay, everybody's happy. Alright. How about some singing? You guys wanna sing? This morning I thought, who the hell would want to be outside right now? Yeah. Well, it was about minus 24, 25, and the humidity made it feel really cold. 